Hello everyone, Butterfly here, and welcome to my blind reaction to Ruby, Volume 6, Chapter 12, titled Seeing Red. Yeah, I, well, obviously we're gonna continue from last time when we had that epic mech battle, which, yeah, it says that was one of the best fights ever, and also we had the Blake, Adam, and Yang stuff, which... Yeah, which would also be very interesting to see how it continues here, unless they don't show us, but... Yeah, regardless, let's just get right into it. And play. This is it. Also, the this is like 13 minutes, this so... There's definitely gonna be a massive cliff candle here. So can't wait for Genlock to start it because yeah I'm definitely gonna be reacting to that. <laughs> Distant clouds move fast. The darkness cannot last. No hope, no path. But we got a dream to catch And we cannot wait Just the way we made The sparrows melt And I messed up I messed up <laughs> I'm gonna read it oh. uh, It's a bit loud Okay, there we go. Something rising like the moon. This is just... This is... Oh crap! Something entered Atlas airspace and... Over there and... Something actually hostile. That's brilliant. Can you make that kind of shot? Well, the question is, is this gonna be that on. good an idea? And because practically staring down the you know. of her cannon. Well, I've got a way to guarantee that. Of course. <laughs> Ruby, what are you doing? She's not wrong, also Oscar's reaction was great. <laughs> Ugh. 
Hospital, we can do this. Hospital has probably had some form of experience with this, so try to draw on that. Or just crash. Well, there's there's something else approaching, so you know. Man is still an ape, though. for your crimes and accept your punishment no <laughs> we're going to atlas bigger people than you have tried to stop us and failed <laughs> but we're supposed to be on the same side we're supposed to use our power to protect people but you yeah you're not getting sued to steal from you we did it because you gave us no other choice now i'm giving you one last chance to stand down and hear us out i've heard enough as i thought she's just gonna be forced to listen by whatever it is that's coming What? What is she the doing? Just springs out. But the raw dust gets locked in. Uh, huh? Oh, nice. What? So Ruby. that's the thing. Ruby. <sighs> Told ya. Yeah, I guess it's not the coming threat that's gonna. Oh, don't that's tell gonna me convince. I missed it. Oh. <laughs> you knew you couldn't oh, win two on one at Haven. What makes you so sure you can win now? I don't have a choice. I have people who actually care about me. And I promised I'd never leave them again. That and also time so has passed. Dying now. And also Yang has learned a bit to fight you know, better. She made a promise you know, to using her head and whatnot. That she'd always be at my side. <laughs> and look how well That was before she found out how Did she make what kind of a person you, you are. <laughs> or to the person you were pretending to be. Exactly. So I just wasn't good enough for you. You know it's so much more than that. I know you've made your choice. And I've made mine. So, what's going to happen here? And hopefully the battle is finished in this one because... Yeah, there's a threat coming as we saw on the raid on the base radar in the base, so yeah. Blake! <coughs> Moment of truth, Yang. Do you think you're faster than you were at Beacon? Oh boy. <laughs> Me neither. Your aura's 
bound to be running low. <laughs> Good job, play. Is she gonna get up or? Hit me already! What does she even see in you? Well, more than what she sees in you. You're just a coward like her. And semblance style. Gotcha. Yeah. Nice. Also, yeah, even if she isn't fast enough, her new arm is made of metal. And I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly, it's from Atlas, so you know. <laughs> it may not be faster. But she has an epic arm. But I'm smarter. Also that. No! Nice. Uh, whoa, is Ow, okay. Looks positively dead. No, don't fall into the... No, Adam, don't. Stay where we can be sure that you're dead. He looks dead, but he might also actually be end. And I'm that. not gonna break my promise. I swear. I know you won't. Oh. So no. back to this no. and the threat you, is coming. Atlas, do you hear me? Never! All yeah, no. Converge on my position and eliminate these pests at once! Trap! Everyone on board! We're making a run for it. What about Yang and Blake? Ma'am, we've been trying to reach you. Argus is in danger. What? <laughs> yeah. So what is it exactly that arrived? A big grin? A gigantic grin. Ooh, the skull and color grins? Oh, a, a Leviathan. Oh. Leviathan. Yeah, that's right. And the uh, mech is down, so... Nice. Oh, SDC. So it is, uh, yeah, last time I actually only recognized the S. I wasn't even sure if the rest were two letters or three letters. But yeah. Sound for a while, but yeah, that was that was chapter twelve of volume six, and yeah, it was a pretty good chapter, and and they managed to defeat the uh, thingy. What's her face? So so yeah, then then that was quite the risky move for people there.
she could have actually died, although, yeah, she's the protagonist, so they're not gonna pull that until at least the very last chapter, or maybe even the penultimate chapter, and which is like way, way later, like, yeah. And also, we also saw the the conclusion to the uh, Adam, Blake, and Yang battle, which, yeah, that was, yeah, that was uh, more or less about what I expected. The Adam gets defeated, well, I wasn't sure if they're gonna kill him or not, which, it seems like they killed him, although, well, I guess, two stab wounds to the chest, plus... Falling from that distance onto that truck into the water, that seems conclusively dead. Although, who knows? They might, they might BS him back into life or something. Maybe Salem finds him or something, or I don't know. Hopefully, they don't bring him back, like because that seems conclusively dead. Plus, it it kind of placed a nice close on. All of that stuff, so yeah, Blake and Yank are now closer than ever, and yeah, bringing him back just doesn't seem like something that should be done at this point. But anyway, also, they really should get back to the others as quickly as possible because apparently that approaching thing was a Leviathan, and it brings many more Grim with it, so. So the question is, how are they gonna deal with it? Because, yeah, Ruby just, just you know, uh, destroyed that mix cannon. So, yeah, and it cannot move and whatnot. So, they don't have they have less firepower against the the gigantic Leviathan. So, yeah, it will be interesting seeing how they deal with it and whatnot. But yeah, also, yeah, next time is gonna be the finale, so that's hype. Can't wait to see that and whatnot, but... But yeah, anyway, thank you all very much for watching, and until next time, bye.